Okay. So I'm in the checkpoint. I'm gonna walk my ass all the way over to that one platform area. Man, there sure is a lot of like looking around, backtracking, and all that nonsense right now. Which I don't really mind. I would mind if I kept dying and kept having to go through these areas over and over and over again. Oh my god, that would make me really fucking mad. That would make me most upset. Most upset. <sighs> Alright, so I just gotta... Wait. What? Thought? Yeah, this way. Pretty sure... Yeah, I gotta go this way. Right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this way. And don't fall. Thank you. And I guess there's a checkpoint here now. Because we're closer to here. And if so happens that I die, the only thing that I'll really have to be concerned with is the dog at the top of the stairs. Which will probably respawn. Um, Yetka was down there. What the hell? I don't understand. Why was she down there? Then she was all of a sudden next to me when I pulled the lever. And I still can't get in that area that she was behind the gate to. I'm sure of it. I'm not going to go check because it's going to leave the area and I'm going to have to come back. And it's bullshit. But now we can go this way, so... Is that the Annihilator? That must be the Annihilator. Um... It's a good thing I checkpointed. Um, what is that? Yeah, okay, I figured. Fuck. <laughs> he looks really strong. And he probably has some kind of area of effect. Oh my god, he's so big! Oh my god! <laughs> okay. It's a good thing I switched to my axe. Otherwise, this would be really unfun. Shit! I gotta learn his moveset. Okay. Drags it back, flings it forward, and then overhead slam. And then I can attack him. Shit. This guy is not gonna give me any opportunity to attack him, I can tell. Ouch. That wasn't so bad. And he's doing a lot of damage, but... And he's got four fucking phases, which makes me very upset. It's a good thing I got 11 potions now. He 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 he. Oh, this is awful. <laughs> this is awful, dude. Shit. That was close. Uh. Alright. So that's all he has. He's got like the two-handed... Not two-handed. Oh shit, I don't like that attack at all. Drags it around and then slams in front of him. Ow, oh, fuck. I mean, I'd say I'm doing okay. Considering I've never fucking seen this boss before, or fought him or anything. Drags it to his his right. <gasps> oh, <laughs> shit. I was going to say he drags it to his right. And then brings it back around so I don't have to worry about that hitting me. And then it just fucking slammed the shit out of me. I'm surprised I didn't take more damage from that. Jesus Christ. So it, I gotta watch for this. And then I can attack him. Okay, so he's in his next phase. I'm gonna heal. I don't know what that's gonna do besides give him like a new move set. Okay, so he's still got that. Still does that. And that, so it looks like not much has changed. Maybe he does more damage now, but as far as I can see, he's still doing everything the same, so I'm just gonna take advantage of that. Shit, no! Oh, that was close. <gasps> oh my god! That is so ridiculous! And it sends you off the map almost. Like, I really hope he can't knock you off the map with that shit, because that would be horrible. I should probably stop doing light attacks. Cause it's not doing much. I gotta be really careful too. I really should be two-handing my weapon, but I'm just not that confident yet. Shit. Shit. Okay. 
Oh, okay, so you can block that. Alright, so now he's in his next phase. Shit. Drink, drink, drink. Don't get punched in the face, though. Whew. Okay, next phase. I'm gonna assume he just starts doing... That's not good. That's really not good. I don't know how to get away from this. I hope he never does that again. He did not summon something. He just didn't. There's no way I believe it. Okay, I'm gonna drink. And I actually am gonna two-hand my weapon because I'm feeling a bit more confident. I don't know if that's a good idea. Actually, it was. It, it actually swung me in the right direction when I hit him. It swings me over to his right. Which is exactly what I needed to avoid his next attack. He's doing that again. I think I need to get away from him. Like, really far away from him. Otherwise, it's gonna hit me. Because I remember the ghost do that same attack, the flashing attack. And the only way to not be hit by it is to be far enough away. So I need to watch out for it. Shit. I should have moved further. Whoa. I thought he was going to do his flashbang. Did he throw his hammer? Yo. That was a perfect opportunity to just like a, literally annihilate this guy. <laughs> annihilate the annihilator. This guy's pretty freaky. Oh shit. Oh shit. That was bad. I got a drink. If this is a flashbang and he electrocutes me again, I will die. So if I didn't drink right there, that would have been the end of it. Throw your hammer. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> I think I rolled last time, so it actually worked in my favor. Come on. Is he flashbanging? Yeah, there's like... I just got so far away and I still couldn't do it. Shit, that was bad. Please don't flashbang again. I think we're golden, dude. Like, as far as everything goes, he's not that bad. Like, this is really annoying. I can't figure out a way to dodge this. Maybe you have to hit him while he, Maybe you have to, like, stun him out of it. That's the only thing I can think of. Also, that's really deceptive. Like, the range on that. I thought I could be closer to him, but you cannot be close to him at all. Or my depth perception is just really bad. One or the other. It might be the latter. Because my depth perception is pretty bad. I might be able to kill him here. Oh... <sighs> That feels really good because, like, this was easily the hardest area I've done in almost any game I've ever played. RPG-wise. I'm, like, silent. I'm having a silent victory with myself. Because, <laughs> like, it was just so stressful that I'm still clenched up right now. Okay, so the big monster dude wasn't the Annihilator. I thought it was. Harkin thought it was. Not a question of can or can't. A chief -o. Lightning hammer, sealed rune big. Defeat Annihilator, the last of the Rogar. So now what? We can summon a deer? I'm assuming? It's like I really want to go through that one door, but it's so far away. And I'll have to fight through so much shit just to get back to this area that I don't think it's going to be worth it. I never figured out what was underneath that place. Maybe that's where it takes you. It's like a shortcut underneath everything. I don't know. Open your eyes, Hogan. You came here to die at the hands of a god. Why fight me? There is much I can teach you. Show you eternity. 
Your first battle was Whoa. an initiation. The first lord I sent upon you was not expecting you to be his match. Really? It's gonna show me everything like that? Killed with Marger. One attempt. So what? I need to fight him? Where are you? Show yourself. Later, you faced this one on the battlefield. It took me seven attempts to kill this thing. Forty-five you minutes. He's trying to turn the tables on me right now. Magnificence. I didn't come here to talk. You also defeated this lord and his minions. Five. Twenty minutes. Look upon yourself, Harkin. You are an outcast. A pariah. You've been imprisoned. Branded. Forgotten. You are more like the Rogar than you would admit. I feel your anger. You lashed out. You brutalized and slaughtered. You are Rogar. You have no place in this world. Face me! You have fended off all the Lord's attacks. Most impressive. You know, this is pretty cool. The Rogar are no monsters. They are man's creation. Sorry, I know it's like really epic right now, but I want to see this armor set that I'm getting. The piece has a demonic origin and a person clothed in it might hear the voices from the bottomless void. I can hear voices if I wear this? Is that what it's saying? Maybe I should just wear it for now and see if I can actually hear anything. Um, I don't think I have it. Hang on. I think the only thing I haven't gotten is the, the gloves. So let's see. The sons of men. They are born out of your anger, your fear, your shame. These are not demons, Harkon. They are mirrors. Reflecting mankind back to itself. You lie! You have done battle with every creature that crossed your path. You even slayed the last lord, leading the offensive on your citadel. And Tannis says he will remove evil from humanity. Sorry. What? There it is. All right. And I have the void shield too. These are the words of a child. How do you separate day from night? Or life from death? Good cannot exist without evil. You twist words to mean what you want them to mean. And then you brought the battle to my door when you defeated my guardian. Your savagery feeds this war. Get out of here. Antanas has destroyed universal balance, and so he has created chaos. By trying to put an end to what he calls evil, he has brought the Rogar forth. Don't you see? With every battle, the Rogar becomes stronger. This war will lead only to your own death and destruction. 
I wonder if that's not what you truly desire. Antanas has interfered in a realm he can't possibly understand. And he will destroy you all if he is not stopped. I'll never surrender. Your true enemy is Antanas. He fears what he does not understand. What he cannot control. Hey, it's uh I forgot your name. Kazlo, is it really you? Hello, Harkin. What's the meaning of this? Are you a deer? No, Harkin. I'm not a god, but I'm not the man you think I am either. Who are you then? Then tell me who you are. The universe requires balance. I am the guardian of that balance. I do not serve Antanas or Adir. I am the true judge. You brought me into this fight to create more violence and chaos. Why? Your capacity for barbarism is equal to that of the Rogar Lords. Before you, Antanas's army was hopelessly outmatched. The Rogar lords would have destroyed them with little effort. Then this world would have fallen into utter chaos. Where is Adir? Why didn't he fight? Thousands of years ago, Adir did come to the battlefield. And that is where we defeated him. He has learned his lesson. There is more than one way to win a war. Adir did not raise his sword against you, but he did offer you a choice. So I'm to be the pawn of an insane judge descendant, or an insane god. Who am I to believe? A man or a god? That is the riddle. Who do you believe? What is this rune Adir gave me? I never imagined a rune like this could exist. It holds a tremendous power, and only its holder can decide how to use it. What happens now? That, Harkin, is up to you. Return to the Citadel. See Antanas. Then, you will know what to do. This is where we say goodbye, Harkin. I can no longer be your guide. Consider this, Harkin. 
You have fallen into darkness and despair and risen to redemption. You know that even flawed and broken men and women can redeem themselves. Look inside yourself, Harkin. Ask for guidance there. The balance of the world is in your hands now. What? What? Oh shit. Is he gonna do me a favor and like teleport me somewhere? That I don't have to fucking fight a whole shitload of enemies on the way back? Please tell me he's like teleporting me outside of the Rogar realm. That would help tremendously. I don't know where we are. The flooded halls? Fight your way back. Oh god, fight your way back to the citadel. Damn it. Spill point shard. Poison resistance shard. Can I go this way? Yeah. Oh, I remember this. This is where big guy was. 